A hand dryer is a wonderful upgrade to your washroom. It will not only make hand drying convenient for your visitors, but also it will help to control the spread of infectious germs and bacteria. And yes, not to forget, your electricity and paper towel bills will reduce considerably as well. In this video, let us look at step-by-step -step instructions of how to install any hand dryer. Step 1. Finding a suitable place. Choose a suitable place for your dryer to be installed. Ensure there are at least a couple of feet spaces between the dryer and any surface there may be under the hand dryer. This will help to prevent the dryer being activated from false attempt. If it is a jet hand dryer, something like the Dyson Airblade, then install it at least a couple of feet above the ground for a suitable reach for all users. Make sure it is not too close to the toilet sink or entrance where it can cause interruptions of people moving with enough distances. Ensure there will be enough room for the electrical wiring to run to the spot where the dryer will be installed and there are no direct contact of water or any wiring is not exposed. Step 2. Unboxing the dryer. Unbox the hand dryer and remove the screws from the shell. The screws sometimes are located on the side or bottom of the hand dryers, while the top is self-locked when installed. Or there may be just a couple of Allen key sockets that would require to be taken out to release the cover of the dryer. This may be slightly different when you install a jet hand dryer like the Dyson. It is usually very self-explanatory when it comes to removing the cover. Please remove to the hand dryer's user manuals which may hold further information. Step 3. Positioning the dryer. You will need to install the hand dryer positioning straight onto the wall. You can do this in one of a few different ways. Either draw a straight line on the wall and keep the hand dryer straight according to the line. It is important that this line is absolutely straight at 180 degrees to ensure that the hand dryer would be positioned straight and not tilted. Or you may want to use one of your tools such as a spirit level or laser tool to ensure the dryer is installed straight for the best user experience. Step 4. Hanging the dryer onto the wall. Have someone to help you to hold the hand dryer straight according to the line or use the provided diagram with the dryer to draw the ports of where the screws will be fitted. Use a marker pen to have a perfect dot or circle for the area. Now use a suitable electric drill and install screw plugs into the wall where you dot it using the marker pen. Position the hand dryer and insert the screws to secure the dryer on the wall. You have finished the first stage of installation. Step 5. Wiring the electric. It is advisable to hire a qualified electrician to install your feed from the mains power using its own fuse and finishing off with an unswitched fuse spur. Some hand dryers come with a pre-built power plug. However, according to UK regulations, it is advisable not to use a wall plug in the bathroom or toilets unless you can install them at a minimum distance of 3 meters away from a basin or water outlet. We recommend you fully avoid using a power plug and have an unswitched fuse spur installed with a hand dryer. Step 6. Finishing off. You can now power on your fuse from the mains to complete all your connections. Now switch the power back on from the mains and try your hand dryer. Your installation is now complete. Keep cleaning the hand dryer occasionally and it will be there with you for years to come. If this video was helpful, please like and share the video.